Hello everyone. It's uh, Monday, November 23rd at 8.20 p.m. here in Toronto, near the University of Toronto. This is College Street. As you can see, it's completely dead. Shop, some shops are open like Subway, um, says Fat Bastard Burritos, but uh, regardless, there is no traffic. And any traffic you do see on the road, pedestrian-wise, they are wearing masks. Um, you can see myself here. I'm walking, I'm not wearing a mask. But the majority of people here are wearing masks outside and inside. It's very rare to find someone not wearing a mask outside. <clears throat> Mass hysteria. Shops are suffering like no tomorrow. And these fake numbers keep going up higher and higher. Everyone's following the protocol of wearing masks. I can see over 98% of the people outside are wearing masks and diligently. Like they're not just covering up not just covering up their mouth or their nose, they're covering up until their 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 eyes. Okay, so they're just what's showing is, is the eyeballs and that's it so masks don't work it's a fa farce it's a fallacy millions of particles flow through every five minutes through the surgical masks even with four layers social distancing doesn't work so if one person is infected the whole area will, will remain infected social distancing does not do anything for prevent preventing illness so some businesses are suffering people are mentally emotionally suffering by remaining indoors not getting fresh air not leaving their homes losing their jobs domestic abuse is skyrocketing domestic abuse is skyrocketing rocketing mental health and depression skyrocketing and even in children children are being raised to look at people without facial expressions without smiling hearing people talking through these ridiculous masks and uh, the numbers keep going up higher and higher and they blame people not wearing masks but majority of people 98 percent i can say when i walk down the street i come to toronto every every three days a week are wearing masks outside and inside.